Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make sure you get notifications about missed calls. You'll be getting an email every time you miss a call. Um, that would be a good option if you work or you find yourself in a place where there's no service at times. Um, any missed call that will, you will get while your phone is off or when you don't have any service, you will not know about it unless the person tells you about it or he leaves you a voicemail. So if there's no voicemail, you will not know about missed calls. Now what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be forwarding my number um, to Google Voice. So anytime I have a, my phone doesn't answer, it's going to automatically forward to my Google Voice and my Google Voice will send me an email saying you got a phone call from this and this person. So the way to go about it is you download the Google Voice app. You go into the Play Store, you download the app called Google Voice. It's right here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open it. And then it says choose a Google Voice number, search for available numbers by city or area code. You do search, you put in, let's say New York, and you select from any number that you want. You could try to change it, you could play around with it. You could get a number that you like. People could also call this number. If you're out of the country, people could reach you by this number if you, if you want that. Now, um, I forgot to mention one thing is that this option of forwarding to your email will only work if it's an American number that you have till now. Um, if you have a, an international number, I'm not sure if there's a way to do this. As of now, I'm showing you how to do it if you have an American number. So right now I have configured my number. If I press, if I go into here and do settings, it's going to say my Google Voice number on the top. It's going to show my link number. And then there's a few settings that you want to change. Um, you don't want to do any of these message notifications. Um, you're going to get a notification when someone sends you a text. Forward call to link number, you want to have it off, unless you want to change that, obviously. Um, what we're dealing with over here is get email alerts for missed calls. That's the most important part right now. Get email alerts for missed calls. You want to have that on. So make sure it's on. And then another thing you want to turn off is screen call. What it does is um, as soon as someone calls you, it's going to ask them for their name. If you don't want to have that, if you don't want to bother people with asking for their name, you could have that off. Now when we're done with that, we go out of the settings. Um, now the next part is to go into the phone settings and set up. You go to the bottom, you go to call. And basically, we're going to be setting up call forwarding. So you go to more settings. And select call forwarding. Basically, what call forwarding does, um, it, well, you could decide which ones you want to use. It should, you could do that. It should always forward, meaning that you should never get a phone call on your phone plan from this number. You should go straight to your Google Voice number. You could do forward when busy. If your phone is busy, then that's when it's going to forward. Forward when unanswered or forward when unreachable. So these are really the two options that I'm using here right now. You want to press on that and put in your Google Voice number, which you can find in your Google Voice app. So as soon as you put that in, press, um, press save or update. And that should forward it to your Google Voice. So what's going to happen is if someone calls you while you're on Wi-Fi, you're going to get the call within this Google Voice app. If someone calls you when your phone is off, you're just simply going to get an email saying, this person has tried calling you. It's going to say the phone number. If you have his contact saved, it's also going to say his um, name. Now, this is going to be the voicemails. If you get any voicemail from anyone, this is going to be your calls. You're going to, you're going to see a missed call. If you see a missed call, um, you can see what time it was made and all that. If someone sends a text to your actual Google Voice, um, number, then you're gonna get it here also. So to recap, if you want to get um, text, uh, if you want to get an email about missed calls, you simply set up Google Voice, and as soon as someone calls you, as long as this setting is enabled, that's very important. This setting, which is um, get emails alert for missed calls, that's a very important setting. If that's not on, you're missing the points. As soon as you turn it on, that should really give you a way of finding out about missed calls. I hope I was clear. Thanks for watching, and 
feel free to comment below.